so it's 11.15 p.m. Um, I've just finished packing. It's taken me pretty much all day. Usually, well, I used to be quite a good packer. But, yeah, it happens. So, I keep feeling like I've forgotten something. And I've crammed as much as I can into a little bag. But, yeah, off to California. Morning, guys. Um, it's half six. I'm a little bit tired still. Might still have a little little nap. Um, but yeah, I should probably get ready. Mm, good night's sleep. So just doing final checks, make sure I haven't left anything in the house. I always get really paranoid that I've left something I've been packing for a while now, so I should be fine. But no, me, I'll probably forget something. Hey, as long as I've got my wallet, my passport, my phone, good to go. We can live in the same clothes for a couple of days, can't we? All right, so that's it. Lock the door. Got my bag with me. Um, quite an emotional thing, you know. Obviously, I've been used to traveling, especially to America, because I've been doing it for like the last four or five years. But uh, it's always like quite emotional. I mean, I'm leaving an empty house right now, but it's just... Not how a car should sound. Um, no, yeah, it's just quite emotional for me. I don't know why, but I'm not gonna cry. You're gonna cry, cryer. Um, so this is the first part of the trip, driving to Nana and Granddad Chapman's house. Um, all right, so let me tell you a little bit about the trip we are embarking on today. Good word, thank you. Uh, so right now I'm currently sitting down the road from a Nana and Granddad's house. They are gonna run me to London Heathrow Airport. From there, we're gonna to fly to Atlanta, Georgia. I don't know what time, I'm going back in time, five hours, so yeah, I'm a time traveler now, that's what I do. Um, just a hobby, it's not an occupation, don't worry. Uh, from Atlanta, Georgia, I'll be there for three hours, hopefully. Uh, then I'm gonna to fly to San Francisco in California. If you don't know it, it's the one with the uh, big red bridge, somewhat famous. Uh, from there, I'll be sort of cruising around California, hitting up the places like Santa Cruz, San Diego, San Francisco, a lot of sands. Anyway, um, and then I'll be there for just over a month, maybe a little bit more. I haven't really worked out the exact days, but you get the gist. Oh, I'm with the vocab today. Um, from there, we're going to be heading to Indonesia, Bali in particular, to find ourselves. Hello, so I'm at uh, Heathrow, made it, safe sound. Uh, start with the bad news, a con, as per. Uh, my flight's been delayed 40 minutes, which is not great. Um, but I mean, it gave me time to have a proper breakfast, had a nice bagel, so that was fun. Um, so where I am right now, as you can imagine, it's quite hard to find space to do this without getting weird looks or anything at an airport. So I'm currently just sitting down a weird, what looks like leads to like a staff room. And the reason I've got my headphones on, I'm not talking into headphones because I don't have a microphone, but I thought it looked weird if I was just sitting down a corridor bit. So this way it looks like I'm on FaceTime, so I'm just going to... Hi, are you right? Yeah, really well, yeah, got it safe and sound. Now people think I'm on FaceTime. It's a tactical game here at the airport. <coughs> you know, it's a real battle. But, yeah, thought I'd just update you about the airport. Um, the main thing I keep doing is walking past the sunglasses store. <laughs> I've been through it like five times now because you walk through it and you keep making eye contact with people trying on sunglasses. <laughs> and they'll have like such a straight face on, they'll have these weird pair of glasses, just don't fit them. Like, fair play, they're trying on something new, but... Uh, so that's, that's probably been the highlight of my trip so far. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna walk around a bit more and see see what's going on really. See if I can find some fun because I'm quite bored and I don't want to talk to you. Music's, music only does so much, so carry on the adventure in the airport, let's see.
and over allow to, I might get told off to bear with. Alright, so landed at Atlanta, uh, quite a nice flight, a bit bumpy towards the end. Uh, I've gone through customs, it wasn't too bad either, got a really nice security guard. Uh, just picked up my bag and now I'm not really sure where I'm going, but we're just going to walk and work it out. So, yeah, but Americans are really nice. Yeah, they've been really nice to me already, so let's go. Alright, so it's 11 o'clock night in California time, literally just arrived, um, I'm shattered honestly, <laughs> it's 7am uh, in England and I left at 9 something, 9am so I've pretty much been out for 24 hours, yeah I'm really tired, uh, didn't really get to film the last flight because I was in the middle seat, it was annoying because it was a really good sunset collect my bag and I'm just waiting for Charlie to come pick me up. Yeah, we'll go from there. So, fun trip. But now the real fun begins. That was motivational, wasn't it? <laughs> Don't worry guys, I'm tired, I can still motivate. Alright. I need some sleep.